I wanted to make another point on my last video. Um, this kind of ties into it. There's a misconception when people say, even myself, I'm guilty of this, that when people say a deck is bad, they don't necessarily, at least when I'm talking about it, say that a deck is, like, bad. They mean to say, like, a deck is bad in this meta, if that makes sense. So, for example, you can play any deck you want. Nobody's going to stop you from playing any deck you want. But your deck may be bad in the current meta. Like, for example, Thunder Family, that's my deck. But I would not play that deck right now if I wanted to have the success that I want. Sure, you can play decks at local over level or whatever, but when it comes to events and when it comes to playing against meta decks, chances are you're going to lose more games than win unless you're playing a deck that's good against the meta or is meta. That's just how it works. That's how this game of Yu-Gi-Oh! works in a competitive scene. Now, if you're not very competitive, you can play whatever the hell you want and don't matter. But I'm just saying, in general consensus, when people say a deck is bad, people usually get offended. Like, if you ask me an opinion on a deck, I'm going to try to be nice about it, but if I say the deck's bad, you should you shouldn't get mad about it. You should... You know, ask me why is it bad, I'll just be like, right now in the game and currently it's bad. There's nothing you can do about it. It's like, if you're going to play a deck, right, for example, um, Fire Fist right now. The deck itself has plays and it has good concepts and good ideas, but, like, what is your bear going to do against Window? What is your bear going to do against uh, a board of two Dantes first turn? You know what I mean? What is a bear going to do against... Clyfords, really, you know what I mean, or however you pronounce the deck, it's not gonna do anything, you know what I mean, like, it's just ironic that people think that, you know, when they say a deck is bad, they get so offended that, you know, they come at your character or whatever it is, but that's just a general statement, I just wanted to, you know, like, kind of put that misconception to rest, decks in general, aren't necessarily bad, but they can be bad in the current game state. Like, I wouldn't play decks like Crystal Beast or... What other decks? I don't know, Crystal Beast, uh, Ice Barriers, you know, things like that. Just, even to the sense like Gustos, even though I play them, you know, they're generally bad. They have good concepts, they have plays, but in the general consensus of the current game state, they are bad. Now, I'm not discouraging anybody from playing the deck they want. You know, you can have success with decks that are, you know, your favorite. You know, you can. You know, you can prove people wrong, or you can do go to an event and just go undefeated with a deck that's totally random. I mean, it, it happens. Chances are, though, that it's not going to. So if you want your best chances of winning, you should not play bad decks. So that's just my opinion. That's how I feel about it. People get butt hurt when you say their deck is bad, but really you're just trying to help them out. That's it. Agree? Disagree? Let me know. So everybody have a good night. I'll see you guys soon. Uh, rumor is that my friend is going to let me borrow his camera. He told me. He confirmed. So I want to get some duels in. Hopefully that will be up sometime next week. Can't make no promises, but that's my plan. So, again, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. And stay tuned. I'll have not an update video, but a little surprise coming next week as well. So, see you guys later. One anti-hero out.